What's up, YouTube? It's me, your boy, and I'm here to talk about Will's comment. Will underscore. He commented on my, do you like being a Navy IT? Will says, hey, I'm in nursing school. What's up? I'm in nursing school and it's not going how I want. I'm looking at OSCT or IT. Which one would you recommend? I have no idea how I feel about working with just radios and such. CTNs and OSs are my top two, with CTT being a third. All right. Well, let's let's just go through this before I start explaining the rates to the best of my ability. Um, I am not sure exactly how why your nursing school is not going the way you want, although. I know it's hard because I was trying to and like I'm not I am bad at at school so I, I get it however if the problem is that schooling is not your thing well, unfortunately the entire like how the Navy works is that you basically are uh, like also a student for the most part learning at all times your job and not your job and just information so if school is an issue just be aware that when you get in the Navy you're gonna go to school a lot also um, you said you're not sure about only working with radios and such IT's work on other stuff not just radios we work on computers and other equipment that's not exactly radios so you won't be just working with radios and it's there's possibility on ships that like depending on the type of ship you might not ever touch the radio uh, because let's say like a carrier they have multiple divisions if you get put in a, like a uh, in an ADP division like a, like your stereotypical IT then you're just gonna be working around going around like fixing computers this, and then you won't ever touch radio. If you go to a small boy, more than likely they're gonna fuse the two NECs together for the most part, like fuse the people who have the two NECs. And then, as a as a person who has studied and uh, took the school for radios, they might just throw me into doing a trouble call. Or as the person who has only been exposed and has like A plus cert, sec plus cert. And all that they might make me do like patching trunks and stuff so it's not necessarily that you will work on radio uh, only there are other things that you could work on but I, I understand because you know like I said you, you they could put you in, in a carrier they could put you in in a radio division and then that's all you'll be doing so you won't enjoy if you don't like that you won't enjoy it um, now here you have OS, CT, and IT, and then for CT you have CTN and OS. So OS, um, I don't know what you're looking for, so I'll just say the few things. OS, advancement rate, good to go. Like, they advance cra crazy fast, like, too, like maybe too much. <laughs> Some people not be ready for leadership, and then now they're, they're at the level. But... OS is, uh, the, the, the joke is that, like, you know, like, E5 and below are, are the same rank because they're all, because they advance so quickly that they basically are just, like, like, the, uh, the junior enlisted are just, like, one thing. Um, so their advancement rate is really good, to, to second class at least. I don't know the percentages. I don't know how it is to get to first. Um. Could be harder, but advancement's good. For um, schooling, they're gonna send you to school to learn whatever piece of equipment. You'll obviously go to A school. I don't know what all their C schools are, but I see them go to school every now and then about, or for um, like, let's say geeks or something. I don't know if I can like say that. <laughs> uh, whatever piece of equipment they have, sometimes they'll, They'll go to school for that. Um, 
So the schooling they do they do do a lot, but not like it's not all the time. Um, in terms of work, like what do like be like an OS doing OS work really only relegated to when they're underway or on a ship. I don't know what all their short commands are. I think it's like instructor duty or something else. But for the most part, when their ship is out in the, the sea, that's when the OS is doing OS stuff. Looking at screens and stuff and sitting in the dark. <laughs> um, can get boring. Sometimes they just be sitting there like staring at whatever they're staring at. But it's easy. Um, just like don't be don't fall asleep. Now other than now when they're not underway, they're gonna be doing every other task that's not related to OS. They're gonna send y'all to tiger teams. Y'all gonna be like tiger teams is a term that we use that means I don't know like what the real definition is, but it's like pretty much like any team that we've created to do a specific task um, is the tiger team. So if, if there's a bunch of paint that's, that needs to be chipped, we're going to form a paint tiger team and then that paint tiger team is going to it's going to chip the paint. And we're going to take two people from every division and throw them in that tiger team. It's like extra information that you like probably don't know, don't need, but like you're always going to be thrown into that. They're going to be doing like they're gonna be doing like food stuff. They're gonna be doing like plumbing. <laughs> they're gonna be doing like heavy lifting. They're gonna be sweeping. Just so you're aware, that's all the things that might end up happening when you're not underway. Um, that will happen to everyone else too, but because there's so many OSs and there's really nothing that they're doing uh, import, the, unless the occasional maintenance, or whatever, whatever they got going on, they will be doing a lot of like other stuff. So it is what it is. So OS, good for advancement, good for good for how easy the job is. Um, hell, there's a lot. There's times where you know, OSs get let off early because there's literally nothing they can do right now. Uh, that's the joke. Like if you see OS. And he's still around at like 1000 in the morning. Be like, oh, we're gonna late. <laughs> uh, and there's, as as my OS friends like to say, there's literally nothing they learn in rate that'll help them out in the real world. I don't know how true that is, but if they all say it, then it's some, you know, jokes have merit. <laughs> Now uh, CT for CTN, the the stigma is that they don't go out to sea. They're usually in a short command somewhere. So if, if you were trying to see the ocean and then you became a CTN, that's that's like automatically like a bad choice. But I don't know all that CTNs do. From what I hear, it's very similar to IT, but focusing on network stuff. So I, I guess. That'll help for after the military when they leave, because then they have, I guess, N stands for network. They'll have a basic understanding of networks, maybe. But uh, other than that, their their job is probably the same as like how an IT's job would be. Um, they're, they're, honestly, they're probably better at certain things because they're more specialized um, at what they do, like I guess network. Um, but you won't see the ship for the most part. Like, if you do, you're lucky, because most of them don't. Uh, I don't know the advancement rate. I'm sure it's the same as IT. Um, now, for CTTs, I, I have, to this day, I have no idea what CTTs do. They, they like, someone in another comment said that I beat around the bush when I answer questions, but I'm not trying to confuse anyone. This is just how I talk. But... CTTs like are trying to confuse you and like they're not trying to answer your questions as to like what exactly they do at least none of the ones I've ever met they're all really like vague with it um, but CTTs they fix something <laughs> I guess 
T stands for technician. Crypto or uh, does it stand for technician? CTT Navy. What's that? Cryptological technicians technical. That's so. That's such a bad acronym. But all right. <laughs> I guess they fix something. But I don't know what CTTs do. I can't really say on how easy their job is. Although whenever I see them doing stuff, sometimes they're just like chilling. Oh, but like working in where they work, yeah, like you will be cold, hundred percent. If you don't like the cold, <laughs> just put that out there. If you don't like the cold, like their space is cold, like bundle up, winter jacket, indoors, hat, hood, cold. Um. But they also, like the OSs, there's a lot of stuff that they don't do while they're not really underway or while they're underway. I don't know. But they're always cleaning. You go down there to where they work in their area, they're always sweeping. Like the OSs, they're just always sweeping because, like, what else is there to do? So, and then I, from what I hear, their advancement rate is pretty decent. I don't know what they can take outside of the, the military. I'm sure they can take something, but I, I don't know off the top of my head. And then IT, as someone in the other comment said, it's easy. <laughs> it could also be not easy. It like, depends on you. Um, but it's definitely good for leaving the military if you actually worked on like stuff while you were in, like getting certs and like learning experience and like networking. Networking as in socializing. But also as well as like networking as in computer networking. So that I guess that's two bulletin points, bullet points. But IT is good if you want to leave the Navy as soon as possible. <laughs> I'm staying in for the full, I think. But if I wanted to leave to next month, I would be set because uh, of the search that I have for my, my C school. I hope I haven't beaten around the bush too much. This was a long video, but you wanted me to talk about three different rates that I don't know anything about. <laughs> but uh, I mean, I hope this helps. Like, I'm gonna be honest, I was really, I was really busy. I saw your answer, or I saw your question, and I, I asked uh, like the people who work at the hospital who are that rate. I asked them to give me a general like overview, and hopefully that was a good enough representation although like i said the ctts are like zip lipped i don't know what their job is still <laughs> to this day i all my friends are ctts like on the ship before and it's like is it's, it's it's like some like illuminati job that they've got like i don't know what they're talking about <laughs> like they beat around the bush harder than i don't know it's, it's crazy but like i said I hope this helps. If it didn't, ask me another question. Hopefully, I'll get it right next time. <laughs> and uh, mm -hmm. I am also going to be putting out the holiday ball that the hospital did. I'm going to put out that video. So hopefully, that doesn't get copyright struck. But I don't monetize my videos. YouTube can't demonetize me if I'm not monetized in the first place. So, peace out, y'all. Until next time.